This is a journey into the seat of Malaysian culture and historical events, where sultans ruled and conquered, and tin was discovered. Perak, the land of grace. Think Perak and think splendorous history, culture, and nature. A reservoir of characteristics which make the state a unique tourist destination. Ipoh, the main city of Perak, is a thriving cosmopolitan commercial center, attracting thousands of visitors annually. Accessible via a half-hour flight from KLIA and less than three hours drive via the North-South Expressway. Arrival by train at the Ipoh railway station will be greeted with its Moorish-influenced architecture, which the locals call the Ipoh Taj Mahal. The city provides a wide variety of modern amenities and facilities, such as superior hotel accommodation by international hotel chains, shopping malls galore, and uniquely Ipoh entertainment. The Birch Memorial Clock, one of Ipoh's colonial buildings, is preserved and remains in tip-top condition, serving as a leading landmark in the city. The Darul Rizwan Museum is over a hundred years old and has housed many Malay chieftains and British rulers. A half hour's drive from Ipoh to Kelly's Castle is a must. An incomplete castle which has been associated with romanticized rumors of hauntings, secret rooms and a labyrinth of underground tunnels. The Leaning Tower of Telo Intan, an architectural oddity in its own right, has since developed a tilt which makes for its special charm. Situated 70 kilometers from Ipoh City lies the Pasir Salak Historical Complex, which documents the remarkable history of Pasir Salak and the people of Perak. Recreation abound for both lovers of golf and nature, such as the Royal Perak Golf Club, reputably one of the best courses in Malaysia. The Maru Valley Resort and Clearwater Sanctuary Golf Resort offer superior facilities for avid golfers. Located in Gopeng, south of Ipoh, lies Gua Tempuro, the largest natural limestone formation in Peninsula Malaysia. It stretches for 1.3 kilometers and is made up of five huge cowards. Other magnificent limestone caves are Sampo Tong, Perak Tong, etc. Another natural occurrence is the multi-tiered Lata Kinjang and Lata Iskanda waterfalls that promises clean, cool fun in clear waters. The Tambun Hot Springs is another hot spot for lovers of nature and those who believe in the healing properties of hot springs. In the name of preservation of the declining wildlife, the Department of Nature and Wildlife Parks have established a river terrapin breeding center that houses hatcheries and educates the public on the conservation of the freshwater terrapin. Towards the western part of Perak lies one of the most popular destinations in this part of the world, Pulau Pangkor, which boasts of sun-kissed beaches and luxurious blue waters, the ideal vacation under the sun. Popular spots include Nipah Bay, Pantai Putri Dewi, and Pase Boga. Pulau Pangkor is also steeped in history, which includes the ruins of a Dutch fort built in 1670, the Batu Basurat, and Fu Lin Kong Temple. Pangkor Laut, the second largest island off the coast of Perak, houses an exclusive luxurious resort, namely the Pangkor Laut Resort. Ideal for swimming and sunbathing, a haven for skin divers in search of marine life. Pangkor Laut was voted one of the best island resorts in the world by Condé Nast magazine. With just an hour's boat ride from Pangkor Jetty, there's a group of nine islands, namely Pulau Sembilan, which play regular host to fishing carnivals, which are patronized by the throngs. A comprehensive marina club of international standards is the International Yacht Club, located in Lumut Town, where the Royal Malaysian Naval Base is situated. Lumut also has its own beach, Telok Bate, which comes with the necessary public amenities for picnickers. Other famous recreational destinations include the Royal Telok Rubiah Country Club 
and the Swiss Garden Damai Laut Golf and Country Resort. Kuala Kangsa, located northwest of Ipo, is Perak's royal town, where the sultans of Perak have officially resided since the 15th century. The Ubudia Mosque, with its Moorish-style golden dome and minarets, is reputedly one of the most outstanding mosques in the country. The imposing Istana Iskandaria still serves as the official residence of the Sultan of Perak since 1933, and the Royal Museum, formerly known as Istana Kananga, is recognized for its remarkable architecture, which employs traditional construction methods without the use of nails. Kuala Kangsa's most idiosyncratic landmark has to be the first ever rubber tree to be planted in Malaysia. The local cottage industries provide a wide variety of handcrafted practical gifts and souvenirs, such as the earthenware water pitcher, labu sayo, the cutwork, or gold embroidery. Perak is also known for the fine crafting of pewter, silverware, and gold. Wait, there's more! Exclusively for the adventurers, the Perak River Safari is an expedition into Malaysia's river ecosystem. The safari includes activities such as jungle trekking, canoeing, rafting and bird watching to suit the varying needs of safari goers. Perak's fame for its idyllic towns is further affirmed through Taiping Town, also known for being the site of 31 Malaysian firsts. The Perak Museum, built in 1883, Malaysia's oldest museum now houses ancient weapons and Perak's rich historical culture and heritage. Not to be missed is the famous Taiping Lake Gardens and adjoining zoo. Taiping Lake Gardens is most definitely a serene yet impressive sight to behold with its gravity-worshipping angsana trees and lush foliage. Taiping is also home to an unspoilt cool hill retreat which is 1,035 meters above sea level, known as Bukit Larut, that comes with a natural waterfall, ideal for an invigorating dip to wake the weariest of travelers. To the northwest corner of Perak, nature prevails. The Matang Forest Reserve is the largest single and best managed mangrove forest in Peninsula Malaysia. Part of the Matang Forest Reserve, known as Kuala Gula Bird Sanctuary, serves as a sanctuary for over 160 species of birds, like the milky stork, and also home to the smooth otter and ridgeback dolphins. To the northwest of Perak is Bukit Mira Lake Town Resort, which is centered around a 7,000-acre lake, which comprises a Lake Town water park, which features the wet bubble and wave pool and Marina Village that promises bags of fun for adults and children alike. To the north of Perak lies Gua Gendang, with natural trails and man-made sites yet to be spoiled by commercialization, it comes strongly recommended for keen trekkers. The widely discussed virgin jungle, observed as permanent forest reserve known as Balum Forest Reserve, it possesses flora and fauna akin to all natural forests worldwide. Another sight to behold is Perak's largest man-made lake, Tasek Temango, covering some 15,200 hectares and complemented by the natural beauty of its wilderness. It is possible to engage in a myriad of activities such as freshwater fishing, boating, jungle trekking, wildlife observation and much more. Situated right in its middle is Pulau Banding, the only island in Malaysia linked to the mainland by two bridges. Adding to the character of this area are the indigenous settlements in the surrounding jungles. The possibilities are unending. Adventure rife and experiences are never quite the same. Perak, which means silver, stands true to its name by extending sterling offerings in history culture and nature. You'll never quite run out of ideas in the land of grace. <laughs>